Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's vlog is going to be all about the Pakistan Society Ball. Paksok is an amazing university society that I've been part of for the last six years and honestly has, has been the source of some of my greatest friends and friends that I know I'll be keeping for the rest of my life. So this whole kind of episode is kind of some footage that I filmed while Paksok Ball was happening. I happened to be singing on stage that day as well, so we'll include some bits of me singing, you know, trying to incorporate the whole music thing into this channel in a sort of sly way, sort of. But yeah, we're gonna start off with my brother coming in for the first time, I think, on the channel. Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. If you're new here, my name's Tim Watt. I'm a graduate and we're at Cambridge Pax Hog Ball 2018. What, what do you want? I don't know, just like... <laughs> Dude, I don't, I haven't perfected the vlog voice. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today is the day of the Cambridge Pakistan Society Ball. This is my sixth year attending. I was president in my third year, my VP in the second year. Uh, it's gonna be a fun event. There's gonna be loads of people here. I think there are about 250 people in attendance. 35 people who've come down from Oxford. Oxford Islamic Society, Oxford Pakistan Society. I then run into my friend Saba, who's an Oxford medic and also has a YouTube channel. And we have a surprisingly awkward conversation on, on camera. Here we go. We then sing the Pakistan national anthem. Uh, this is actually a tradition that I started three years ago when I was president. Previously, we never sung the national anthem at the ball, but India Sok did it, so I was like, you know what, let's have some national pride, guys. Let's sing our national anthem, so. <laughs> We just kicked off Paxog Ball. It's looking to be an absolute cracker, a belter of the ball. We just had the national anthem. As usual, none of us diaspora know the lyrics, but that's okay, because all you have to do is stand up and put your hand on your chest and nod approvingly. This is Omar. I'll cut, touch base in a moment. So that was one of my closest friends, Omar. He's, he's quite the character. Uh, but now, the moment you've all been waiting for, we've got some clips of myself and my friend Rupa singing Perfect by Ed Sheeran at Paxog Ball. Here we go. So that was some of our performance of Perfect. Uh, we also did a mashup, a four chord mashup, where we sang a bit of Moana, a little bit of I'm Yours, a bit of Can You Feel the Love Tonight, a bit of Black Eyed Peas, a bit of Pehli Nazarme by Atif Aslam, and we ended with Don't Stop Believing. So that was, that was really good fun. Uh, all in all, really fun performing with Rupa. Uh, you can see at the end of that song, at the end of Perfect, the crowd absolutely loved that little kind of hand-holding thing we did for about five seconds. You can't do much more than holding hands on stage at Paxok Ball because then the crowd's gonna like have a stroke or something, but you know, a little bit of hand-holding and you know, this really gets them riled up. But <laughs> yeah, really fun performing that. Now we've got various people that wanted to be on the vlog and actually some people that I forced to be on the vlog, uh, one of whom you might recognize from, you know, he's a big famous YouTuber and they're just saying nice things about our performance and nice things about the ball generally. Hi guys, it's Isma here. You just missed the amazing performance I'm holding it and the vlogger as well. Okay. <laughs> the people were singing along. So hopefully it went down well. Hey, I'm Nalifa Ahmed, a third year geography student at Cambridge. I'm loving the ball and this is my outfit. <laughs> Hello guys, my name's Hashim. I'm Mehrab. I'm Zach. I'm a first year medic of Magdalene College Oxford. I'm Connie on my gap year. First year LSE PPE. And we think Ali Abdal's music performance was perfect. Was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Mahiz, I go to Oxford, I go to Oxford, I go to Oxford. I'm... I can't do it, I can't do it guys. Astonishing. It was truly a pleasure to be in the audience. This guy should be on Broadway. Truly the greatest performance in Paxwood Ball history. Thank you so much for gracing us with your theatrical presence. Ali's performance was so good. Like you could see the emotional connection. Everybody was loving it. Everyone was singing along. It was just so much fun to watch. And Hi, I'm Samaya. I'm Sarah. So we're both fourth year medics from Oxford. And we've come all the way to Cambridge for the ball today. And we're really excited to be in Ali's vlog. Because we're big fans of the YouTube channel. Not really, not at all. <laughs> so I've had a lot of messages from people 
who are from ethnic minority backgrounds and are worried that, you know, I don't want to apply to Cambridge because I know that it's mostly white. And yeah, Cambridge is mostly white and that's probably not going to change for the foreseeable future. Although they are working on it, the access department is really good, the communications department is really good. But you know, it's it's stuff like Paksok and India Sok and Bangla Sok and Somali Sok and there's all, sort of, there's all sorts of societies that you can get involved in whether you're an ethnic minority or not. So yeah, if you're looking for contact with ethnic minorities, then there are loads of amazing societies at Cambridge that, that offer that. I don't think that alone should be a reason for not applying to Cambridge. Um, just my two cents on on that front. So yeah, other than the performances at Paktok Ball, there's like a five course meal and there's performances that we had a Kowali people this time around. And then at the end, there's always like a dance floor that opens up where everyone kind of gets involved. <laughs> and after all that was over about 1 a.m., we all headed over to Christ College where there was a big after party in their JCR. And that was just full of loads and loads of Asians, just like absolutely knackered, just sitting there and chatting, which is quite nice. And now to complete this vlog, we're gonna cut to uh, stuff that happened the following morning. All right, so it's the morning after Paktok Ball. We're hanging out in Pembroke College and we've come here for brunch. This is like like a, a traditional thing um, that after Paxog Ball uh, all of our lot and all of the Oxford lot we all meet up at Pembroke Brunch. Everyone here is looking refreshed. We've come to Pembroke Brunch to revitalize ourselves with some good fodder and some saccharine treats. We're here for the waffles. Nothing cures a hangover from Paxog Ball like waffles at Pembroke Brunch. It was a wonderful night. Most of us have recovered. It's been almost 12 hours since Ali and Rupa performed their tour de force on stage and yet still in my head the haunting cries of, of the women in the crowd and their wonderful singing are reverberating in my head. What an, an extraordinary performance. So yeah, I hope that gave you a reasonable taste of what Paxok Ball is like. Uh, it's pretty much just like one big event in the year where you get 300 brown people in a room together uh, and like celebrating Pakistani culture and people doing performances and like loads of good food and yeah, it's generally quite a good time and it's a good excuse uh, to meet our friends from Oxford and LSE and other kind of universities that come up to Cambridge just for that purpose. So yeah, thanks very, very much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please consider doing so. Have a lovely day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.